Hey guys, welcome to my channel and uh, we get the new optional quality update in Windows 10 laptop and desktop. Okay, to update it, first go to settings. Okay, now in settings, if we go in update and security, so you can see optional quality update available 2022-02 cumulative update preview for Windows 10 version 21H2 for x64 base systems KB5010415. And guys, the size of this update is 653.3 MB. And if you want to know more about this update, just click on learn more. And here go to Windows 10 version 21 H2 update history. So here you can see February 15, 2022, KB5010415. Just click on it. So you can see. So you can see the highlights, new, provides the ability to share cookies between Microsoft Edge Internet Explorer mode and Microsoft Edge. Updates an issue that uh, causes Microsoft Edge Internet Explorer mode to stop working when you press the F1 key. And updates an issue that affects dialog boxes in Microsoft Edge Internet Explorer mode. Updates an issue that uh, causes screen re readers to describe a back button as button rather than back button. And updates an issue that uh, sometimes causes the Chinese simplified input method editor to become completely unusable. And here are improvements and fixes. And you can see the known issues in this update. You can see how to get this update and many more things. Okay, so now close this window. So guys, you can see download and install. Okay guys, when you are ready to download, download and install this update. Okay, now I am going to download and install this update. So you can see downloading start. Guys, it might take some time. As you can see, two minutes completed and installing. Okay, so this is a really good thing. You can see what is this? I don't know. Now it is showing installing 0%. Okay. After previous experience, I couldn't say that how much time it will take. And guys, there is no need to stuck on this window. Just minimize it and do other tasks. As you can see, 10 minutes completed and installing is currently at 0%. I am waiting when it will move. So you can see installing moves at uh, directly. Yep, it is directly jumped to 20%. Here you can see. 13 minutes, 12 minutes and uh, 39 seconds completed. Okay, you can see it is directly jumped to 20%. Guys, 25 minutes completed and the consent stalling is at 20%. I'm waiting when it will jump again to another number. As you can see, 35 minutes completed and installing is currently at 20%. The stalling process is very slow. Microsoft have to work on it. It needs improvement. So guys, you can see it directly jumped to 44% from 20%. So you can see 35 minutes and 46 minutes completed. Okay, now I'm waiting when it will jump again to another big number. Guys, 44 minutes completed, 42 minutes. Guys, 42 minutes completed and you can see installing is currently at 44%. I'm waiting when it will move. No, it will not move, it will jump to another big number. So you can see, not a big jump, it's starting at 45%, move only 1%. So you can see again, again jumped to 73% from 45%, you can see installing 
73 percent guys 47 minutes and uh, 40 seconds completed and you can see installing at 73 percent it again jumped to 73 percent from 45 percent So you can see installing 74% moves only 1% you can see 57 minutes and 27 seconds completed as you can see guys I can see the installing process is really slow it is a time consuming task. Guys, one hour and ten minutes completed, and consumption starting is at seventy-four percent. Okay, this is a really bad thing. The installing process is really, really slow. Here you can see. Microsoft it need improvement. I can only say that uh, this uh, update process need improvement. You can see it is really slow and laggy. So you can see installing 75% moves only 1% you can see. Okay. I'm still waiting when I will get the restart now option. It is a really slow process. So you can see now it is moving, installing 78-79%, okay, a good sign, now installing is moving fastly. So you can see installing is moving. And please do not again start from zero. Um, now I'm waiting from restart now window. So as you can see installing is moving. The speed is good now. We need this speed Microsoft. You have to work on it. So here you can see installing 100%. Okay, now I'm waiting when I will get restart now option and please, please, please do not again start from zero. Let's see. So you can see one hour, 15 minutes and 18 seconds completed and it is at installing 100%. So guys, uh, this is a really good thing. I got the restart now option. The whole process took one hour, 15 minutes and 31 seconds. Here you can see Windows update process need improvement. Yep, it really need improvement. The process speed is really really slow and laggy so it need improvement I can only say so you can see after the restart this update will successful install okay guys thanks for watching if I have any query to this video let me know in comment section below please like share subscribe and click on bell icon for all latest updates